sure about this? I mean, it's not some tiny cable station you're infiltrating. Zal mentioned an Eliza and a phone call to Picus. Put them together, it has to mean Eliza Kassan is in on this. You don't think that's a bit of a leap? The world's most famous news anchor working with a mercenary hit squad? We can argue the fine points later. Set me down on the tower. I'll get in from the roof. Jensen, it's Pritchard. Malik tells me you want Eliza Kassan's location. If it's not too much trouble. It's not. I bypassed the firewall easily, and I've pulled up a 3D model of their floor plan. Her office is in the tower, room 404. On my way. Jensen, something's not right. Pikus is a 24-hour global news network. Why isn't anyone answering their phones? I'll get back to you on that. Hello, Adam. Does Al tell you I was coming, Miss Kassan? Please, call me Eliza. Zhao Yunru did not tell me. She does not know you have discovered this connection. So how did you find out? I have been watching you for some time. Ever since receiving orders to temporarily disrupt satellites over the Detroit metropolitan area six months ago. The night Megan's team was taken. You jammed their GPL so everyone would think they were dead. Yes. Although I only came to that conclusion later. I find my realization... disturbing. I wish we could discuss this further, but it seems I have alerted them to your presence. If you leave now, you may be able to escape. Oh, I'm leaving. But you're coming with me. I am sorry, Adam. I truly am. Jensen, get out of there now! Tell me you saw that, Pritchard. Later! Right now, I'm detecting multiple radio signals converging on your location. It's a trap! We knew that. And I'm not leaving without Eliza Kassan. So find her while I look for a way to get downstairs. Four oh four is clear. But he couldn't have gotten far. Don't be too sure. This guy's good. Well, if he's in here somewhere, he must be scared. I'm sure he can't expect to keep his point firepower. Keep looking. Understood. This is fucking boring. Richard, have you found Eliza Kassan yet? Possibly. 
Back in room 404, I detected a hollow processing cloud more sophisticated than anything I've ever seen. It was sent from an area of the complex that wasn't showing up on the 3D layout. You found a secret lair. A sub-basement level that somebody spent an awful lot of time trying to conceal. It's connected to the tower by a funicular. Look for a staircase in the back of the TV newsroom and you'll reach it. Find you, you little shit. Jensen, I've been tracking your progress through the 3D layout. You're close to the funicular. Any chance it's sitting there waiting for me? Where would the fun be in that? You'll have to call it and wait. Oh, and Jensen, when you do, they're going to know where you are.
That's done it. They'll be converging on your position, and the funicular will take some time to get there. It isn't a high-speed elevator. Great. Not to worry. I'm sure your new friends will make the wait interesting. I'll keep you up to date on his progress. Thanks for nothing, Francis. is halfway there, Jensen. is there, Jensen. Get moving. Jensen, I'm beginning to think that not everything is what it appears to be at Pike's communications. And what gave you that idea? The hidden sub-basement, the fact that a 24-hour news network has been cleared of all workers, or the heavily armed guards trying to kill me? Spare me the sarcasm. I'm talking about how easy it's been to bypass the firewall and access their systems. At least, parts of them. Whatever do you mean? I mean, I feel as if I'm being directed to some areas of the network and kept away from others. Only no security system I know of can do that on the fly. Figure it out later, Pritchard. If I'm gonna catch Miss Kassan in action, I need a more accurate destination than the secret lair. The hollow processing cloud you encountered in room 404 was accompanied by a massive power spike. The spike originated in one of the sub-basement's bigger rooms, 80211. I suspect that's where she broadcasts from.
jumping around over there? sophisticated AI program, so they say. But I have started to question that. Ever since I realized what my interference had allowed, the day I started watching you. This is impossible. People would know. Would they? I was engineered to monitor communications and data streams. To find out what people are talking about, and make sure it's being discussed correctly. Correctly? And what if it isn't? Then my programming allows me to reshape it. You spin the news. Control what people see. Who created you? Whose policies are you programmed to protect? Zhao is one of them, I think. But there are others. Tell me. Who else is involved in this, Eliza? Where's Megan Reed? Who ordered the kidnapping? I want to tell you, Adam, but I cannot. Why not? Because she won't let me.
Her life signs are fading. Will you save her? I'll think about it. Will you answer my questions now? I cannot tell you where Reed and the others were taken. They vanished from the global grid as soon as the doctor removed their GPL implants. What doctor? This is Sandoval. Why are you calling me here? I know this guy. He's Bill Taggart's aide. He was a trauma surgeon before he became an anti-augmentation activist. Would you like to hear more? Yes. There's been a change of plans. Seraph's team must not make it to the hearing. But that's too soon. If you want me to remove the GPLs, I'll need a full operating suite. Does the facility have one? Barrett assures me it does. FEMA. That's where they were taken. But why? Why take them at all? An acquaintance of yours has the answer. David Seraph. Seraph? I have copied the audio transmission to a handheld playback device. I suggest you take it and leave quickly. I have more questions. And I have already told you too much. This passage will take you to your companion. Just be careful, Adam. Because everybody lies. Jensen? Eliza Kassan just contacted me and told me I should meet you here. You ready to go? Yeah, take us home, Malik. Amen to that.